Welcome to the official Windows 8 channel. In today's a video about the uh, Bing Weather app, I've had the uh, first video talking about the Bing Weather app um, and how to uh, use it and set your city. But I've got an interesting question about someone saying, well, okay, now I have some cities added, but I want to remove, and I don't know how to do it. So this one is going to be um, pretty much showing you how to add and remove cities um, as you go along with the uh, Bing weather app. So, um, of course, first thing you need to do is go and touch your Bing weather app or uh, click on it. If you don't know where it is, you can uh, actually go and slide to get a charms bar on the right side of the screen by sliding from right to left or going to the corners. If you have a uh, non-touch device, go in the corners with your uh, uh, arrow. And uh, you can click the search and go into weather and it's going to bring you that little icon with a sun in the middle. And that's the weather app, the Bing weather app. If it's not set up, it's actually going to show you um, a sun in the middle of the uh, tile. Now here it's set up with my own city which is Montreal and showing you how beautiful it's going to be this week. Um, if you right click on the app you'll notice that it brings up two charms uh, on the top and at the bottom with menus and stuff and um, there you can actually go into what's called places. Places lets you choose different spots around the world. For example here I have Montreal, I have San Francisco. Uh, you can click the little plus sign here. Search for a city. So for example I want to know London in England. So you'll just type in London, England, United Kingdom and there it adds itself there and you can click on those tiles and get the weather from this, uh, these different areas. Now I added London and I'm thinking well I don't really need San Francisco. So what do you do? You simply go to the places once again so if you're in your app remember that you can actually just right click anywhere on the screen go into places and um, if you right click on one of the tiles, so for example I want to take San Francisco out, I'll right click, the tile is chosen and at the bottom you'll notice that one of the information here is uh, remove right there. So I'll just click remove and as soon as I did that <coughs> it removes that city from my weather list. So um, this is basically how easy it is to just add and remove cities in your area and um, just click back your own city if you want to uh, know what weather uh, we're going to have so um, don't forget that the uh, app scroll so if you have a touch screen just scroll uh, towards the left and you'll actually see all the menus here and including the uh, long-term forecast hour by hour so um, it's pretty cool for that and of course you can slide it back if you have a touchpad usually two fingers on your touchpad on the laptop will uh, either go up and down if you uh, just go up and down or left and right if you go uh, from left to right and if you want to go back to your regular forecast well you just you know click your home city once again so uh, this is how to add and remove uh, some cities in your Bing weather app. I've seen a lot of weather apps. I've seen the AccuWeather app. I've seen uh, here we have a local app called um, the Weather Network in Canada. They are okay, but I must say that the Bing weather app is absolutely gorgeous. It's a very beautiful app. Um, and apart from the fact that it's sometimes a little off in the weather and the uh, temperatures, uh, I must say this is a uh, very, probably the most beautiful weather app available for Windows 8. And actually a little story behind it is that there's a, uh, when they designed Windows 8, um, there was a lack of really good apps. And they actually took a team at the Microsoft uh, site and they told them, 
you guys are going to build apps and that team actually is uh, built several apps including this weather app and all the apps that they actually made are all very very beautiful so uh, this is really nice uh, the news app is also really superb so this was how to add and remove cities and manage your cities in the Bing weather app if you have any comments or questions let us know if you enjoy our channel maybe you got that new Windows 8 machine and you're a little lost click the subscribe button and you'll be informed when new videos are online and if you have uh, if you enjoy our channel well, I hope you come back and check our hundreds of videos on how to do just about anything in Windows 8 so thanks for watching hope you come back to the official Windows 8 channel bye bye